Walmart, how dare you? Walmart, how dare you? This is amazing. What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Long time no see. I have not recorded a YouTube video in over a month and it feels wild to be back, but I'm back and I hope you're happy that I am. Okay, today we've got a banger. Walmart recently came out with a new clothing brand within their stores. It's called Free Assembly. And I went there a few weeks ago and I saw that this line, Free Assembly, had a bunch of different jeans, denim options. And I was like, oh, I gotta bring it to the girls. I gotta bring it to the table. I gotta test it for the girls. So that's what we're doing. Doing today I've got a full try on haul of free assembly Walmart brand jeans we've got some hits we've got some misses but the hits are bangers like you guys are not ready when I tell you please watch the video all the way through everything that I'm trying on will be linked down below with my sizes as well as my current measurements so you guys have good sizing references I'm really pumped about this video I think that you guys are going to be too so let me not ramble on any further if you're new here welcome subscribe down below I promise I'm gonna be making more videos very soon and it's a good old time over here so let me not ramble on any longer because I'm so excited for you guys to see this let's jump right in to this free assembly by Walmart try and haul Okay, you guys, our first jeans up are the high rise skinny. I am super out of breath because these took a lot of energy to put on. These are the high rise skinny. I got them in a size 14. I also luckily picked up a size 16, which is good because these are so, so tight. I feel like the 16 is gonna be a better fit for me at the moment, but these retail for $27. And honestly, for a Walmart brand, I feel like they are really, really high quality. They're reminding me a lot of Universal Thread from Target, but overall like a really great quality denim. If you want a good high-rise skinny jean I feel like this is a great option they actually are really nice and flattering and fitting me well too tight to like sit and do activity so I think the size 16 is better for me but overall the fit is super flattering it's a really nice quality denim and I'm definitely highly impressed Walmart good job so we're starting off this haul on a high note I know there's a big controversy on whether or not we're still wearing skinny jeans but if you are more power to you and I feel like this is a really great option Okay, you guys, these are the high rise skinnies in the size 16 in a lighter wash. And the 16 was definitely the way to go. These are a lot more comfortable. They're still really nice and figure flattering. A lot easier to get on for sure. I definitely feel like I could sit in these. There's a tiny bit of room in the waistband where when I sit, it won't dig in too much. Um, looking good all the way around on the butt. These are actually reminding me a lot of American Eagle jeans. They're a really nice, great quality denim. These also retail for $27. I think Walmart is killing it with this brand so far. I feel like free assembly is to Walmart what Universal Thread is to Target. Like they're really good, like solid denim brand. So yeah, I'm really impressed so far. I don't really wear skinny jeans. I like to try them on for you guys, but I don't really wear them anymore. So I'm really excited to get into the next few pairs that are styles that I actually do wear. I do have different sizes in some of them too. So we can compare and contrast also because I didn't really find a lot of sizes of them. So I just kind of grabbed what I could. But yeah, so far so good. Walmart, you're killing it. Okay, guys, next up we have the Free Assembly Mid-Rise Boot Cut. I got these in a size 16, and I feel like I'm kind of in between sizes because they're a little bit baggy, like mostly around here. Like this just makes it look like, I don't know. I don't like when this part of jeans are baggy. That's why I usually like, like my jeans a lot tighter, but I feel like the 14 would have been too tight. So definitely just between sizes right now. The butt looks good in these. I'm not really sure how I feel about the mid-rise. I don't know that this is like that flattering on me. I feel like it just makes me look wider here because it's not cinching me at my waist like I like it. But you guys can tell me, I know a lot of you guys always ask me to do mid-rise because you're not into the high-rise, which is why I picked these up. You guys also asked me a lot to do boot cut, so I got that. I think they're a good length because they're a little bit long on me right now, but the moment I put on a boot, and most of the boots that I wear tend to have chunky bottoms, it'll be a perfect length, it'll hang over the boot perfectly. And I feel like this is a good length because not everybody is short as hell like me, I'm only five, barely 5'2". I'm really like 5'1 and a half. So if you're any taller than me, then this will still be a good length. Not my personal favorite pair of jeans, but I definitely still am impressed with the quality of the denim, the sizing, everything like that. So one thumbs up for quality, but we're not going to give it the two thumbs up because these definitely aren't a pair of jeans that I would wear, but some of you guys might. It's been quite a while since we've had one of these moments. <laughs> these are the 90s OG straight jeans in a size 14. And this is, that's all she wrote, folks. That is all she wrote. But don't you worry, I got a bigger size. And I got two sizes up because I kind of anticipated this happening when I looked at the jeans and felt that they had very, very, very little stretch. So we're equipped. We are equipped to solve this problem. But if you are wondering, size up if you want the straight jeans. Let's try on the 18 and see if we even like them to know if it's worth the size up. Let's go. 
Okay, y'all, I forgot that I bought the original 90 straight in two different washes. This is also a size 14, but this size, I mean, I will say they got a little bit further. They did not get all the way up. They definitely don't fit. But between the washes, the lighter wash is cut a little bit bigger. So I'm thinking that we're gonna try on the size 18 in the last wash, the darker one. We're gonna see how that fits. But I feel like for the lighter wash, you can maybe just go up one size. Like I feel like I could have made a 16 work. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know what the jump between the sizes is. But for the other wash, it definitely needs to go up two sizes. So we're gonna see how the 18 works out and then go from there. But like I always say, size on the tag does not matter. It does not matter what that number says as long as you feel comfortable and confident. And these right here, doing neither of those things for me. So they will not be staying in my life. We're gonna push this negative energy to the side and find some better jeans, okay? So let's do it. Okay, so listen, Walmart, y'all got some splaining to do. Why is this a size 18 and it still won't zipper? Also, why is this still not a good pair of jeans? I really thought that this pair of jeans was going to be life-changing. I was gonna be like, guys, run to Walmart right now. But like, even if they zipper, they're really not even that great. I was really hoping that these were gonna be a dupe for my good American, good curve straight jeans, which I live, breathe, and die for. They're my favorite straight jeans ever. These are not giving what it was supposed to give. Like, it's just not there. But I do think, honestly, I do think the lighter wash is the better pair at this line. And I think I need to go to Walmart and hunt down the size 16 in the lighter wash because I liked those better. Like even just looking at them on the hanger in the closet right now, they look so much cuter. So I think, I'm sad that I don't have those to try on for you guys, but like, damn, like they're not even meeting me at my waist. Just the fupa of it all. I'm really disappointed in this, man. I thought these were gonna be a solid winner. You guys, I have very low hopes for these shorts. These are their rolled denim shorts in a size 16, and I really didn't think they were gonna fit, but now that I have them on, I love them. First of all, the length. For anybody that has thick thighs that gets chub rub, I feel like this is a perfect length of short because they're clearly still shorts, but they're not like Bermuda shorts, but your chub will not rub because you have the protection there. Also, a nice high rise. I usually get a huge gap with denim shorts back here, especially if they're more of like a, a mom jean denim short. There's really barely any gapping. Good butt coverage. Your cheeks will not be coming out of the bottom. Overall, I am highly, highly impressed. I really feel like Walmart just did something here. I feel like these are gonna sell out, be the talk of the town. So I'm gonna need you to click the link down below and get them before that happens because I feel like you all need them. You all need them. I'm, ugh, the wash, everything. Like, I know it looks kind of weird because I'm wearing long sleeves right now, but like, imagine this with just like a bikini top and a cover up to go to the beach. Like, so many, so many options. Like, wow, I'm so impressed. Walmart, good job. I got another pair of the shorts in the darker wash in a size 18 and I'm obsessed. Like there is a little bit of gappage back here, but honestly, I'm not mad at it because like, look how great my butt looks. Look how great my butt looks. Look how perfect this length is. Like Walmart, how dare you? Walmart, how dare you? This is amazing. Oh my God, they're perfect. I thought I was gonna have to go on a hunt for good denim shorts for like the entire season, but like first pair that I try are amazing. Are you kidding? Walmart, you really did the damn thing. Guys, when I tell you, click the link right now and buy these, you better fucking buy them because they're gonna sell out. I can guarantee these are gonna get sell out. Walmart, my message to you, make millions. Make millions, make millions of them because everybody will buy them, I promise. I will buy them. If they don't sell, I will buy them for you, okay? Okay, you guys, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, everything I tried on will be linked down below with the sizes that I wore as well as my current measurements so that you guys can have a good sizing reference. I am really excited about this one. I feel like the shorts really stole the show. I'm telling you, you guys, pick up those shorts right now. They're gonna sell out. I can guarantee it, they're gonna sell out before next week. I'm just gonna make that call. They're gonna sell up before next week. So the moment you see this video, buy them before it's too late because I'm obsessed. I'm truly obsessed. I thought I was gonna have to do a whole deep dive hunt for the best denim shorts for curvy girls on the market. And like, did I just nail it on the first try? Oh my God, I'm still probably gonna do that video by the way. So subscribe, stay tuned, but wow. Like, wow, Walmart, you really did it. But thank you all so much for watching. I truly, truly appreciate it. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button before you head on out. If you watched all the way through to the end, you might as well join the fam. You can also follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. My handles are super Ashley127 on all of my platforms. I love you all so, so much. Thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.